So this PX9 is probably one of the best pistol values that I've ever come across. And I just wanted to show a quick update and it works really well with this particular gun. And I didn't think it would, uh, but it does. So the PX9 is, uh, it takes SIG P226 magazines. And I found these three magazines, they are P, uh, Metgar P226 20 rounders. So they're 18 rounders and they have the little extended base plate as you can see. Uh, it's a plus two, so that way you got 20 rounds per mag. And I saw it at a pawn shop and I figured, you know what? I have some extra mags at home that I don't use. So I went in with a couple mags that I didn't use and the 15 round mags that this came with and I traded them off for these uh, SIG mags. And it's a great, great uh, choice that I made. I'm really pleased with it. That's why I wanted to share it. Uh, first off, this gun is pretty much what the Springfield XB should have, XD should have been, in my opinion. I really, really dig the Zagana PX9. Uh, I, I didn't think I would. I thought, well, when I got it, it was only 219 bucks, so it's a hell of a deal. As long as it works, it'll make a good utility gun. And now I'm just looking at this thing going, man, I'm really glad I got this. It has Philippine National Police markings on it. It's kind of cool. It's good design. Now I got these mags for it. It's just a beast of a 9mm. And just to show... So here's the magazine in the gun, and it actually goes with the lines of the gun very well, which aesthetics matter to me. I know some people it doesn't, but uh, the aesthetics matter to me. Um, it's, it's one thing to buy guns just for utilitarian purposes, but it's a plus if the guns just look cool while you're buying them. So anyway, the magazines work really well. See, there's no issues at all. Uh, again, these PX9s, they do take SIG P226 mags, so no issues there. If you guys have any P226 mags or you're thinking about getting them for your PX9s, uh, at least for this generation, this is the first gen, I believe. They have up to Gen 3, or actually, I believe this is the second gen. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe this is the second gen, and then they have the Gen 3s, which double check on those if you have a Gen 3 PX9, if it takes a P226 mags. But just wanted to show awesome the aesthetics are amazing and i'm really really pleased with it um good quality magazines good quality gun I, turkish guns are kind of weird like that you have some turkish guns that are amazing and some that are not so amazing uh for a while i thought the sa the sar9 was one of the better choices out there for a turkish gun and i actually have one i have an sar9 and maybe i'll do a comparison between these two but this one is a lot more refined better constructed and it's just better in my opinion. And I'm saying that even though I got the SR9, I won the SR9, um, it was like a sweepstakes or something, and I won it. It was a SHOT Show deal, so I won it. And uh, the SAR9 I like, it's a really solid gun, but this thing blows it out of the water, especially for 219 bucks. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you, that these, P these uh, the Metgar uh, 20 rounders work really well with this gun. They fit the aesthetics really well. And uh, if you're looking for something for your PX9, uh, check these things out. All right, thanks a lot for watching. As always, stay safe.